I'm back with another video and in this video I am going to show you this look on my face right now. I've been so in love with it. You guys it is so warm out now which I am just like feeling it. I'm feeling the warmth. I'm feeling the spring. It's a wonderful thing. It's a wonderful thing. This look is really easy you guys. I was just really heavy handed with the light eyeliner and I'm like absolutely obsessed with the way that it came out. I think that my eyes look nice and big and popping which is awesome. So yeah thank you guys so much for watching and please subscribe if you haven't already and let's get on with the tutorial. Okay so first I'm taking the Lancome Photogenic Lumisense foundation and dabbing that all over my face and then I'm going to take my Sephora beauty sponge and blend that all in. Then taking my L'Oreal Brow Stylus, I'm just going to do my brows. If you see me talking through this in beginning parts, because I was talking on the phone with my friend at the time, so sorry about that. And I'm just going to fill these in how I normally do. And then I take MAC Pro Longwear Concealer and put that underneath my eyes, on the bridge of my nose, forehead, lip, and chin. And then again, I blend that out with my beauty blender, or a beauty sponge. Then taking the contour stick from the Smashbox contour sticks, I just cream contour a little bit and blend this in with my H&M buffing brush. And then for my nose, I do like to use the beauty sponge. Then taking this Beauty Crop Lightning Crew, I am going to cream highlight a little bit and then again blend that in with my sponge. And then taking MAC Emphasize, I'm just going to set all that with my e.l.f. blush brush. Then taking RMCA, RCMA powder, I'm going to set my whole face. And then I'm going to contour with the middle shade of the contour Anastasia Beverly Hills Contour Kit with my NARS Eda brush. And then go in with my Butter Bronzer and this Morphe brush. Then highlight with the Hourglass Ambient Light Palette, this Morphe M438. And then Milani Luminoso with the Real Techniques blush brush. Then I'm going to take this fluffy Morphe brush and start blending Makeup Geek Peach Smoothie into my crease. This look is just all about just blending, 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 and just doing a nice light wash of brown in the crease. So you'll see here, I just start blending all these colors together in the crease. So first, first Makeup Geek Peach Smoothie, then Makeup Geek Creme Brulee. Just to deepen it up a little bit. And then MAC Saddle, again, just to deepen it up a little bit. And then I do go in with a little bit of Makeup Geek Chickadee just to kind of warm it up. You can't really tell, but it warmed it up a little bit, which I like that. And then I'm going to take the NYX Wonder Pencil, and this is um, totally what brings this look to life. I just take this and really overline my waterline and my inner corner. Like, I go ham. Like, I'm not even kidding. Like, I go crazy with this thing. I love it so much. It's not very long lasting. I'm still in the search for long lasting, but it really brightens up and I really like it. It doesn't irritate my eyes either. And then I do kind of highlight my Cupid's bow too there with the stick. Just going in some more. Like, see? Woo! It's bright. Then going in with MAC, all that glitters, I just put that on my lid part. Just to brighten up that lid, and then after I'm done with that, I go in with MAC Nylon and put that in on the inner corners of my eyes to again brighten it up. Then I'm going to take this e.l.f. contour eye brush and just take all three of those colors and start blending them underneath that white, kind of going over the white so the white's not so crazy. But yeah, then I just take um, a fluffy brush after I'm done with that and just kind of blend everything out. That's how I like to make uh, this this bottom lash look not so crazy. Then I'm going to go in with Clinique Moisture Surge and spray that all over my face and then taking Becca Champagne Pop I'm going to pop that on my um, cheekbones and my nose. 
just highlight a little bit more. Then I'm going to take these Ardell 110 lashes and stick those on. I poked myself in the eye. It really hurt. <laughs> and then I'm going to pop those on. And then going in with L'Oreal Telescopic just to kind of blend those in and get my inner corner and my bottom lashes. And then taking ColourPop Midi, that is what finishes up this look. This is seriously such an awesome nude. I love it. And then just curl these lashes. I like to just blend my lashes with the falsies. And that is it, you guys. Thank you guys so much for watching. I really hope you try this out. Let me know if you do. And I will see you in my next video. Bye!